the Meridel Center is having their haunted house for the year, and they're having their last four showings this coming weekend and middle of next week. Every year, the Meridel Center hosts a haunted house. Jerry Mackley said that it's really about providing good Halloween entertainment and having fun. Well, people just, they like that adrenaline rush that they get from being scared. Um, and even people that don't get scared, like me, I don't get scared in haunted houses because, you know, I work in the industry, but I just enjoy the thematic elements and the creativity of it all. And so I figure either I'd like to scare people and give them that fun adrenaline rush, or if we can't scare them, then at least we can entertain them. And so for me, our haunted houses are a little bit more theatrical than some others. Um, there's always a storyline that carries throughout the whole haunt and some of the actors do have lines that kind of further the story along. Others do just jump out to scare you, but um, you know, so between the storyline and the actors with lines and the elaborate theming that we do, you know, if we can't scare you, at least we want to entertain you. And, for the most part, people do come out smiling. Now this year, they decided their subject was going to be Dr. Frankenstein. And the story of their haunted house is that Dr. Frankenstein actually created more than just two monsters. That's right, he created many more monsters, but those monsters were a little bit dumb, and they couldn't find their way out of a spooky labyrinth that Dr. Frankenstein created to test how smart they were. Now it's your job to go into that labyrinth and find them and chase them out before they chase you out, that is. Haunted House has been going for three weekends now and there's four more showings left. This weekend on Friday and Saturday as well as the 30th and 31st of the month. There's also going to be a single hour walk through this Saturday for the kids and the faint of heart. Saturday the 27th um, from 6 to 7 p.m. we have a less scary show for younger kids or people who just don't want to get scared. And during that one hour, um, the monsters won't be jumping out to scare you. We actually take the scarier monsters completely out. And so the actors are in there and they just pass out trick-or-treat candy. Tickets are $12 a piece for the regular show. And if you want for the less scary one, it's only $8 a piece. Thanks to our sponsor.